channel. It's a lovely Wednesday and I'm here with another rack, um, a sneak peek rack of what's to come for next week. Um, as usual, I'll probably have a little bit of, of it up by Friday, but the majority of this will be up next week. So if you see anything you like, you can always shoot me a message and I can let you know when it'll be available or we can um, set up something through DMs. That's always a possibility too. I do have PayPal. So um, with that aside, let's go ahead and get started. Got a pretty decent sized rack today. Um, this is White House Black Market, and this is a size 12. It's just a black and white. This is a nice lightweight. It's probably a rayon fabric, um, but it's a nice lightweight blouse. And yes, it's 100% rayon. It's just got kind of a floral abstract print. The trim along the neckline is actually embroidered, but the rest of this is just printed. But it's just a really nice, blouse. I love this. This is a Talbot size 8 petite. It is a no iron fabric. It's a really great, really more of a holiday winter style, um, but it's a popover with a couple little diamond buttons at the front and then there are some diamond buttons on the wrist as well. Love this color plaid in the winter. Got a Chico size large. This is a lightweight sweater. It's knit. It's got this really cute one button detail at the front. It has pockets. Um, I believe the length on this was long enough for some people to wear it as a sweater dress, but I think um, it's really more of meant to be one of her leggings. Uh, it does look pretty long here, but I'm pretty sure when I measured it, it was a little on the short side. So just FYI, check the measurements on that if you're interested. Um, Adriana Vittadini, size large. This is just a great shirt to toss on for work. I love this color combo. It's like polyester. It does have a slight texture to it. Got a White House Black Market um, button down sleeveless tunic. Um, it is very long, but it has high slits. So it's definitely to wear over skinny jeans or with some leggings and it's a nice lightweight polyester. There is one snag on the side here that will be noted on the listing and priced accordingly, but it's still a really nice top. Got an Ann Taylor size medium. This is a heavy knit it's stretch fabric. It's not really a sweater, but it's also not really a t-shirt, if that makes any sense. It's got this cute kind of ruffled bell sleeve and it's just a nice shirt. You could wear this on the weekend, but it's also professional enough you could wear it to work. It'd be really cute with a statement necklace too. It's got a Harry Potter t-shirt, Mischief Managed. That is just too cute. Kind of like it for myself, but don't need a Harry Potter t-shirt at the moment. Got a Knox Rose little peasant blouse. Um, it's blue and white. It has embroidered trim up here on the hem. The tassels on this are so cute. They're like a layered tassel with different shades of blue. Very cute. I'll brush those out a little bit before I list it. But it's just a really cute little peasant top from Knox Rose. Another great work shirt from Coldwater Creek. Again, no iron fabric. This is a size 1X18, size 18 a lavender purple and it's just a really nice three-quarter length sleeve button-up blouse. Nanette Leopore, this is a size one. I'm actually not familiar with the size chart for this brand so I will have to look up to see what the one um, translates to but it does look like it's probably a large maybe a maybe a 1x. It is a little bit bigger. It's really cute um, ruffled sleeves. Feels like feels like silk, but it's polyester. Got this Knox Rose size medium, open front. Um, it's a little more casual to me, but it's a burgundy cardigan. It's got dolman sleeves and this long sheer lace hem. Kind of a boho look. Would be cute over a dress. Got a loft extra large. Um, this is a silver metallic knit gray cardigan. It does have really pretty diamond buttons. I can't tell if they're diamonds or just clear. I think they're actually diamonds. It's, as you can see, got this kind of sparkle shimmer to it. 
This is a really nice classic cut on this cardigan. Got a Reebok work wrap tank top in a small. This is a slim fit stretch workout top. It's got an open back, racer back top. It does have a built-in bra, but it's not padded. We've got a Chica Zenergy size uh, medium, lightweight windbreaker with a leopard print. It is not hooded, um, but it does have kind of a thicker collar and it's a zip front. And again, it's nice and lightweight. Got a loft medium long sleeve polyester blouse. The base color is cream. It has the slightest hint of pink to it and it's got this blue kind of geometric design on it. Nice shirt for work. We've got another Chica's Energy in size one. This one's a t-shirt and it has this kind of zebra animal print on it, but it has it in this really cool color combo. I don't know if you can see in the lighting, but there is some silver in there as well, along with the purple and black. And the neckline, if you can see that up close, is actually got sequins on it. Cute little tee. This is a motherhood maternity shirt. This is a great one for work as well. Um, you just toss it on and it does have this little waist sash. It's a really skinny sash tie and it's just got a little v-neck. Um, I don't know if you can see the coloring. It's kind of a blue-green color. It's very cute and it's a size medium. Again, that one's a maternity shirt. We've got a mave top and an extra small. This is an oversized fit. It has a kind of a baggy dolman sleeve. It's just burgundy and white polka dots. Pretty classic print. Oversized boxy fit. Got a Loren, Ralph Loren size 1X. Um, this is like a thermal shirt dress. So it's that textured kind of waffle knit. Got some buttons on the front. It's just a pullover style. Um, has a nice lounge vibe, but you could probably get away wearing this to the grocery store as well. Columbia size medium button up. This is a really lightweight. It's almost sheer. 100% um, cotton. Yes, 100% cotton. And it's just a lavender and white plaid. Again, this one is a really lightweight cotton. Got a made color block dress. Um, it's a stretch jersey knit fabric. It's navy and a cream color. And then the rest of the skirt is just black. This one is size small, again from Maeve. Very cute, classic. Another Harry Potter t-shirt. This one has the castle of Hogwarts on it. I love the gold foil on it, it's really cute. That one is a size large. We have a Chico size large, lightweight cotton popover. Um, this one has a really cool Aztec geometric leg print on it. It does have a little tie front. Uh, this would be great for any vacations coming up because it's lightweight and it's still pretty warm out, but it has fall colors. Very cute top. Chico's. Got a soft surroundings tunic in a medium. This is a button down front in like a dark gray. It's almost kind of like a washed out black. The buttons on it are pearly see that. This one is much more like heavy in weight so it's definitely better for fall and into winter. It's got a really nice look to it so you could easily throw this on over some skinny jeans or wear it to work with dress pants. That's how it kind of has like professional casual vibes if that makes any sense. It's a really nice shirt. All right Cold Water Creek size 14 petite. This is just a nice pink floral button-up. Um, I believe it's a cotton, it's kind of like a medium lightweight, very pretty. Oh, I love these. This is a Pure J Jill um, cotton crew neck tee and it is 95% Pima cotton, 5% spandex. It is red. Uh, if you haven't worn J Jill's Pima cotton, you need to. It's so soft. Uh, the stretch in it is perfect. 
it's a longer style so you can wear it with leggings or you can wear it just with jeans i love these i would buy them in every single color if i could got a chico size large this is a sheer polyester tunic um, it does have roll tab sleeves so you can roll it up or wear it long it's got this kind of green and cream I don't know what you would want to call this print, kind of a tie-dye lined. Um, it's got this kind of fold-over look. And this is the back, so it is longer in the back than in the front, but it's kind of an asymmetrical design. This is great to throw on over leggings. Got a cold water creek size extra large. This is a navy blue t-shirt, I'm sorry, not navy blue, royal blue t-shirt and cotton three-quarter length sleeves and as you can already see those fabulous sequins along the neckline that just looks beautiful makes me want to wear it <laughs> with my red lip it's giving me snow white vibes <laughs> okay we've got an ll bean size medium uh, this one is supima cotton and it's also very soft it's kind of got this cowl turtleneck and it has like a very colorful, it almost looks like a floral splatter print. I don't know what you would want to call that print, but um, it is a long sleeve. It's like a medium weight cotton. It's got a nice stretch to it. LL Bean is always really nice, good quality. Chico size two, which is a large. We've got a striped tunic got these great pockets right here. Now this is also really great to throw on over leggings or skinny jeans. You can still wear it with black dress pants. Just a very versatile top. Alright, this is Harley Davidson and it's probably the cutest Harley Davidson shirt I've ever seen. It does have a flaw. I haven't decided if I'm going to try to repair it or just sell it as is. Um, but it definitely needs to go to someone because it's gorgeous. Um, as you can see, it's studded out. Um, I'm not really sure. I'm, the print itself isn't really that exciting for me, but I love the studding. So sparkly and so pretty. Here's where we've got our damage. We've got this little hole up here um, at the neckline, but then the back has this beautiful beaded embroidery detail on the top. This is just so not Harley to me. I love it. It's gorgeous. Um, Again, so yeah, I don't know if I'll try to repair this somehow or just sell it as is, uh, but a super cute top from Harley. Got an Under Armour Thermal. This is just a really classic thermal. It's kind of more of a slim fit and it's got a pink kind of camo logo on the front. No thumb holes, unfortunately. Looks like it would be one that has thumb holes. Okay, we've got Eddie Bauer, an extra small thermal. This one's a V-neck. This one's a little bit thicker and it has the buttons, kind of like a cute little thermal Henley. Very nice from Eddie Bauer. It's got a Bowden t-shirt in a size 12. It is a layered shirt. It's cotton. It's kind of heavy since it is layered. Um, so this blue shirt, even though you can't separate the pieces, they are connected at the shoulder seam. It does actually, it is an actual double lining, if that makes sense. So um, even though it's kind of a faux layered look, it is actually another layer of fabric underneath. And it has this kind of cute little neckline. Just a really basic top from Bowdoin. Got an Athleta skirt in camo, not camo, military green or olive green. Um, it kind of has like a tennis skirt look to it, but it's more of like a hiking material moisture wicking fabric. And this does not have anything underneath it. So it does not have shorts. Um, it's not lined. So keep that in mind if you're interested in this athleta skirt. This one is a size 10. I've got an Adidas golf polo in a size small. It's got this little triangle textured kind of argyle thing going on. So it is a little bit sheer. You can kind of see behind here that you can kind of see through it. And it does have this 
button that lets you do like a high neck, but I doubt most people are interested in actually buttoning that. <laughs> and it's just a short sleeve and blue. Got another Soma sleep shirt. I just love picking up Soma. Um, this is a purple in a size medium. This one's a long sleeve pajama shirt. Has a little pocket here. And um, again, it's just that classic buttery soft stretchy fabric from Soma. Cloth and stone. This is a size small. Um, this is probably long enough to be a dress. So I'll call it a dress, but some people might be more comfortable wearing it with leggings. Uh, this is red and gray plaid. Very soft, it's actually very lightweight as well. This makes me wanna go to a cabin and like make s'mores. Who's with me on that? <laughs> I love this. Okay, I'm so ready for fall and I'm in Texas and it's unfortunately gonna be up to 99 degrees today. So definitely nowhere near fall. I'll probably be getting in the pool here in a little bit. So. Um, Eddie Bauer, size small. This is another kind of golf style polo. It does have a really subtle stripe. It's kind of a bluish gray color with white stripes. Just a nice polo. Got a Wild Fox graphic t-shirt. It says, see no evil, hear no evil. And it's a really lightweight, kind of a burnout ringer tee. Got Ralph Lauren rugby, size medium. Got a buffalo plaid dress, another one that's screaming to go on a camping trip. This one's actually a really thick flannel and um, it's buttoned down all the way and it does not have side slits. It does have um, a roll tab sleeve option and this is just a great um, fall winter dress. I love this. This is from Soft Surroundings. It's a size small. It's the perfect fall jacket in like a burgundy color. It buttons down and then it has, as you can see, the back kind of goes a little longer. It's got this really pretty crochet trim on the wrists, on the pockets, and on the back. Super cute. This is like a jersey knit stretch, but it's thick. Um, it's just really a cute jacket. I like this a whole lot. It'd be really cute with some boots. Brown boots, specifically. It's got a Talbot size 12. This is a really great career interview blazer jacket. Uh oh, I'm getting a stream of light coming through my window. Um, it's navy blue, so it's pretty classic. This would be a great interview coat or you had an important meeting to go to, you just throw it on over some navy blue dress pants. This one's a Talbot denim jacket in burgundy. I'm probably gonna try this on afterwards and I may or may not keep it. <laughs> it's so cute. It's a really nice like stretchy denim and I just love the way this looks. It's so cute. We'll have to see if it's my lucky day or not. Got a Banana Republic coral reddish orange cardigan. Uh, it's a V neckline. The buttons have a little BR on them, so they've got some little detailing. And it's a nice stretch, lightweight cardigan. I actually did try this one on because this is my favorite color to wear. Um, unfortunately, it was just a little tight in the shoulders, so this is a size medium, but I feel like it runs just a little bit small. This is also super cute. Another vacation shirt. Uh, this is a Talbot size medium. Um, this is a sweatshirt. It's a lightweight navy blue. And as you can see, it has these embroidered patches all over it. It's got the Eiffel Tower, a croissant. So if anyone's going to Paris, you need this sweater. It is adorable. Got a J. Crew Factory outlet sweatshirt. It's a lightweight. You can kind of, as you can see, see through it a bit. So it's a lighter knit and it's short sleeves. This is a great layer in sweater. Got a Joan Bass size medium. 
a tan knit sweater tunic front um, shorter than the back this is like a really classic sweater it's made really well it's super soft um, it has an exposed zipper at the back this is perfect for I feel like this is perfect for someone my age kind of in their mid to late 30s you could dress it up with like a long necklace or just wear it plain you could wear it with dress pants you could wear it with jeans there's a lot you could do with this and it's just a really classic kind of closet staple sweatshirt and it's a little bit oversized so that's great for you know if you're not feeling hot or whatever <laughs> perfect okay forever 21 this is just a really cute little christmas sweater i'm trying to decide if i want to refashion this one um it's a size medium and i thought it would be kind of cute to put like a slogan on here like um i don't know if something funny like um yeah anyway I don't know if I'm going to sell this as is or if I'm going to zazz it up a little bit. Got a Chico's No Iron Linen size medium button down. It's got a nice colorful print. It's kind of like a paisley peacock vibes <laughs> pattern and um, it's just a nice linen top. Can't go wrong. Got an Ann Taylor extra large houndstooth short sleeve knit sweater. It's kind of that heavier um, stretch knit versus like a cottony one. If that makes any sense. It feels more spandexy. Nice. This is also a great layering top. All right, we're almost done. I'm getting there. I feel like I'm talking slow today. Got a Chico size medium. This is another great kind of classic top that you could wear casually or to work. It is lightweight, it's textured, so all these little spots have kind of a textured feeling. Um, you've got paisley print and then like geometric, but it's all in kind of a black, grayish, white. It's a really nice top. Got Anne Klein in a petite medium. This is a zip front chambray top and just kind of a medium wash blue. It's got little button details. This one is actually new without tags. It's missing the original store tags, but all these little metal buttons still have that kind of plastic stick them attached. So it's not been worn. Got a Soft Surroundings 1X tunic in light blue. Um, this is a lightweight top, but it has this really cute crochet trim, some kind of embroidered detailing, and some pleats on the front. Very cute little top here. All right, we've got a Gaiam size large draped front sweater, and it has that kind of faux wrap look. This is really cute. And this is soft, it's nice. Got J Jill size small, got a patterned t-shirt material but it's a tunic length and it has this really fun tassel hem chico's size extra large lime green pima cotton blend tee so it's really soft just like that jj one i was raving about this is the same fabric just from chico's Got a loft size extra small. This is a striped blouse with bell sleeves and this bib front here is embroidered. This is a cute fall top. Okay, we've got some pants today. Um, we've got some Brooks Brothers size 10. This is from the red fleece line and it is a dark green. I know the camera's there. It's not picking it up the best, but dark green and it's like a chunky corduroy. Just really cool. It's kind of a boot cut. Don't see that too much. The corduroy, which I love. Got a loft size small textured lightweight top. Has a ruffled hem at the sleeve. And it's really just a basic. It's almost like a thermal, but it's a little bit lighter. Whoopsies. Ugh. Okay, back to some pants, some bottoms as I knock everything over. Okay, this is adorable. This is from Jones Wear. It's a size 12. This is a heavy wool blend pencil skirt. 
or just a skirt, I guess, but it's a wrap and it has these really cute black leather buckles on the side. I love this skirt. It is a longer length, super cute. Classic colors, black, cream, and gray. Got some Eddie Bauer hiking pants in size six. These are the kind, they're that moisture wicking lightweight. You can wear them full length or you can unzip them and you've got a pair of like Bermuda shorts. Got a loft size two, it's the Marissa trouser. These are kind of a rose gold, you can see that shine in there. It's like a rose gold tan cream color. These are very dressy. They're soft and kind of slinky, um, but they do have a little bit of a dressier appearance with that shine in them. Got a loft size eight. This is the Julie trouser and it's in a black and white plaid. Can never go wrong with loft dress pants. a loft Marissa trouser in a size six petite. This one is kind of a blue with a hint of gray and it's kind of got this speckled look in it. If you can see that, it's kind of got that white speckled appearance, almost like it's wool, but it's not. And again, just a really nice dress pant. And another loft. This one's the Marissa Skinny in a size four. This one is um, a blue plaid and it's got different shades of blue in it. So it's kind of a dark blue, a little bit of a black navy-ish plaid pant. And again, this one has the skinny leg instead of the trouser. Got this really cool Calvin Klein size seven denim skirt. It has a full zip front and it's kind of like a heather gray and red. The red is obviously like a very light muted red. It's almost looks like it's acid wash, but it's just like a heathering. It's a really cool skirt. Got another pair of the loft trousers in a size 14 petite. These are like a denim chambray. They, they look professional enough for work, obviously. They're a dress pant, even though they're supposed to look kind of like a denim. few more. We've got another pair of the loft dress pants. This is a size 10 trouser. This one is also a plaid and it's got burgundy and navy blue in the plaid. You can see that. It's kind of hard to see the colors that way and I think my lighting is going south. <laughs> Bowden size 10. Just a basic Bowden dress. It's gray with yellow and white flowers and it does have um, pockets. It's a midi length, super cute dress. And the last thing we have today is this Land's End pop over top in a size two. It's blue and white stripes and it's got this really pretty embroidery on it. The back especially, very cute. And it just feels like a dress shirt. It's really nice. All right, that's everything I have um, as far as clothes go. I do have more shoes, but I think I'll just do the shoes on another Instagram Live here in a bit. So um, hope you like what's all coming up next week. And I guess stay tuned next week because there'll be another video. So um, thank you for watching. Bye.